For this Access Advisor video, I'm taking a look at a bit of Lanzarote where we went on holiday in February. We flew from Gatwick Airport with British Airways to Lanzarote and it was a wonderful trip. Everyone was really helpful. Getting on the plane was no problem. We stayed at Puerto del Carmen and you can see it was the Lanzarote Village Hotel. This was a view from our bedroom. The bedroom was good, level access, had a very big bathroom, very spacious, and the balcony looked out to the sea. I recommend anyone who's thinking of going to Lanzarote, I would recommend this hotel to them. Coming out of the bedroom, we went down towards the lobby. You can see that the slopes are quite a good gradient. And also in the hotel near reception, there is another accessible loo, which you can use if you need it. So from reception, sorry, from the loo through to reception, again, very level flooring. Everywhere was accessible. The swimming pool didn't have a hoist, so that was a bit of a problem. Um, in the end, I didn't bother going in anyway. It was February, so we just, uh, I just sat by the pool, apart from the times we went down to Puerto del Carmen and automatic doors at the hotel. There's the pool, and as I say, no hoist. A lovely pool, good size. Here we are in Puerto del Carmen. The pavements are wonderfully smooth. There's a dedicated bicycle lane so you don't get uh, hit by anyone on bicycles. The shops, I would say, quite a good few of them were accessible. And if you did get to a place where there were steps, you just had to go a bit further along, right to the end, and you could access the supermarket, the restaurant, and any of the other shops that were there. And now we're coming up to one of the favourite places for my wife and I. We found this little hideaway hidden away down at a quite a long slope. And as you can see from the video, I'm a bit of a coward, so I prefer to reverse down. I think in wet weather, this might have been a bit more slippy. As it was, it was okay. And once I reversed down it, no problem. And once you're down at the front, you've got a beautiful view of the sea. There's a lovely restaurant and a cafe. Tables set out, beautiful colours. You can go all the way along. I do believe there's a, there's a seated area up here which you can relax with some cushions. And it really was wonderful. We also used the cafe at the other end. This is just showing you the video. The cafe was Cafe La Ola. It was accessible. Not only was it accessible, but it also had an accessible loop. One of the other things we did was take a very long stroll down to Arecife Airport. You can go just at the end of the runway. The pavements are fine. There was no problem at all. And on the way back, we stopped at Matagorda. And again, there's a complex here of shops and bars. And as you can see from this video, they're not steep ramps and they thought about it. They're good gradients, easy for a powered wheelchair. Um, I guess they look okay for someone who's pushing themselves but I wouldn't like to say for myself here was one that hadn't been finished so I had to be a bit more careful about that but there was good access and so lots of cafes and bars again just quickly showing you how easy it was to get in and around we stopped for a drink at one of the bars beautiful sunny day in fact most of the holiday was quite sunny so down another slope I've tried to cut this down so it's not too long, but it just shows how easy it was and how accessibility in Lanzarote seemed to have been catered for quite well. Out on the pavement and the walkways, we found another hotel that had a good slope, so presumably that was accessible. And near the end of our holiday, we took a taxi to Arecife and just showing you how easy it was to get on the taxi or get in the taxi. The taxi drivers were really helpful. We picked it up at a hotel stop. And in Arecife, again, some of the shops are accessible. There were quite a few that weren't. But we had a good stroll through the town. We didn't do the hotel. There's a hotel there. You can get a lift to the top floor and get a wonderful view of Arecife. But we did look at the harbour. And I got some lovely photos of the harbour for our memories. And it was a very beautiful place. 
One of the things we did do was take a ride on a noddy train, which was a tour of Arrecife. It was a bit steep, getting on a very short ramp. I'd say it was about 40 degree angle, and there was a little lip at the back, but undeterred, we did it. And here you can see me on the train. And this is a kind of view that we had looking out of the train. It was a wonderful tour, took us to some very wonderful places. You can stop off at various stops on the way and pick up the next one if you want. But that was our trip, and that was Arrecife and Puerto del Carmen. And that was my experience of Lanzarote. I hope you've enjoyed. Please like, share and subscribe if you have. And there are the credits. Thank you to Disabled Access Holidays for arranging the holiday for us. And of course, thank you to my trusty Autobock B400 power chair. Bye.